How's it going, YouTube? This is Crazy316. This video has nothing to do with homosexuality, atheism, Christians, whatever. This is a tech video. Um, for those of you who don't know, I'm into computers and decoding. My, my, um, my field of study is CIS programming. Okay, you remember, you see, you're, you know the um, unmark as spam button on YouTube? Or um, the button that says not spam? You know how it doesn't work? Well, I was messing around with the coding in YouTube and I figured out a way how to develop your own URL to make it work. And I'm going to show you step by step how to do that for those of you that want to know how to unmark certain comments as spam because it's not spam. Because that really got on my nerves and so today I was messing around with it <clears throat> and figured it out and it worked. So um, let's go over that right now. Now I'm going to take you the long way around so you can get a feel of how to screw with coding and make stuff work for you instead of waiting for YouTube to fix things. So for this example, I'll start off with my video titled General Update 33009. Um, I really don't want to unmark these comments as spam because this guy is an, an idiot. But I'm for the purpose of this tutorial, since it's the first one that I could find, we're going to use this example. Scrolling down, we can see that the comments, we can see that it says right here, um, comments marked as spam, and it has the show button, right? Okay, when I click on show, we see that it's Lot and Daughters. Some stupid troll that posts this stupid comment that I've already um, refuted. But notice the not, not spam button doesn't work. Well, what you're going to want to do is, you remember how you click, scroll all the way down and click on uh, view all seven comments, or why is it seven, but it's view all comments. Click on that. To where you have all the comments pop up and in the URL box at the top you're going to want to delete everything except for HTTP slash uh, colon slash slash www.youtube.com uh, slash comment underscore serve let question mark everything after that you're going to want to delete next what you'll want to do is you're going to want to go to view and scroll well for this is for Mozilla Firefox go to view and click on page source or what you can do is right click anywhere on the page and just scroll down to view page source not info but page source okay now you're going to want to go back to that that other pay, uh, that other window that you had open with all the comments scroll down and find the um, comment that you want to unmark as spam and expand it for example I'll use this one and you're gonna wanna copy some of the text this is gonna be the easiest way to find the the correct one to unmark as spam when you're in the um, when you're in the page source window so go ahead and copy that like I've copied this little bit of section right here and then go back to the page source you're going to click on edit and find this is Mozilla Firefox once again people the little find box will show up down at the bottom and you're just gonna paste what you said what you had paste what you copied into that find box okay once you've typed in in the find box which the text that you've copied and you're looking for it will automatically jump down to the comment and highlight it in green. Right over that, you're going to have to do some looking now. But it's not hard. It's if you scroll a little bit up from that comment, there's going to be all the little command codings for all the blocking and unblocking and removing comment. Well, you're going to want to look for the one that's in red where it says comment uh, servlet. Remember, right over the um, right over the uh, highlighted text. So don't go past into another comment. But luckily Mozilla Firefox has color coded text in the um, in the source. So I hi I've highlighted the um, comment servlet code that is going to be red right here. Okay, people, this is the end of the tutorial right here. Directly to the right of that comment servlet um, that you see right there. It's it, there's a um, 
where it says post body and then there's a little uh, apostrophe right after that apostrophe you're going to want to copy that that ampersand sign unmarked comment as spam you're going to want to copy equals and that long code that it gives you want to copy all that right before the last apostrophe so you don't want that last apostrophe but you want to copy in, you want to copy everything in between those two apostrophes now once you have copied that from the source you're going to want to go back to that other window where your view all comments window is remember I told you to delete all the rest of that um, that URL except for the um, everything before the question mark and the question mark itself well right after that question mark you're going to want to paste what you just copied and hit enter and it's going to give you this message it's not going to look pretty but it's going to be XML format it's going to say the met the comment has been marked which is a success message that has been successfully unmarked as spam and what you could do is you can go back on your video refresh the page and see if it's showed back up as a regular comment and sure enough here we see that it has exactly worked just as um, I said it would work so this tutorial is just for the people who actually care about that kind of stuff I know it drives me nuts when one of my friends comes and posts a comment and it says that it's been marked as spam and I don't want it as spam I want it to show up so any of you have this same problem you can use this tutorial to fix your YouTube channel your, your YouTube uh, video pages um, this is crazy 316 I'm out